Hey, my little trilobites. This is our usual disclaimer that you can read. Yay. So I went to the store and I filmed things and I was trying to be stealthy and I am like, I am not stealthy. Okay, like I want to be, but I'm, I'm totally not. And, um, but yeah. Uh, cr oh my gosh, like our, they put an Ulta next to a Marshalls and a Ross, like it's hilarious. But anyway, so I have this on mute because there was music playing and obviously I don't want to copyright patent infringe on music that I don't have permission to use. So I just have this muted. But yeah, there's, t oh my gosh, there's so much stuff, so much stuff. And then I'll show you what I bought afterwards. But, I mean, we're talking, I found, yeah, I would, like, put everything in the cart that I thought was, like, interesting. And then I'm like, do 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 I'm trying to be stealthy. And, of course, it's President's Day. And, like, the stores are so crowded. And I'm like, oh, my gosh. Like, I'm just, like, waiting for them to kick me out at this point. Like, seriously. Like, I found a lot of Kopari. Tons of Kopari stuff. Sorry, it's probably blurry. That was, like, $14.99, I think. I mean, they just have, it's like overwhelming. And then I found this empty shelf and I was like, oh, Venus 2 palette. That's seven ninety nine, And I'm like, wow, that is really awesome. And then they even have, they had tons of Clinique. Oh my gosh, they had tons and tons of Clinique. But some of it wasn't as discounted as like I would have hoped. So that was kind of a bummer. But yeah, I mean, just tons and tons of palettes. And I'm trying not to drop things either. Four ninety nine. Like this, this is crazy. I feel at least I put everything on shelf. This, I'm so shocked I found that. Because that is, like, really old. That's from, like, the brunch series. Um, so I was like, ooh, if I find the brunch one, maybe I can find, like, the blueberry one. But, to, no, I did not find the blueberry one. There's Becca Cosmetics, tons, Jaclyn Hill, Morphe. Um, so much Morphe. It was just, it was nuts. Like, twelve ninety nine, And these palettes were in, like, perfect condition, too. So I was just, yeah, Anastasia palettes. Riviera one, those are on sale for 20 not too bad, and Cara Beauty, which I never actually tried, but I was really tempted, because that was really, really pretty, and then the Becca Sunsetter, which is, I've heard really, really good things about, too, another Morphe palette, there's just, there's just so much Morphe, it's ridiculous, like, massive, massive Morphe. Like the big palettes, the huge, huge, huge palettes. And they had so many of the big, huge ones as well. I was like, I don't even know what to do about this. So many palettes, so little time. But do I need like 55 palettes? No. And then I found these, and I thought these were cool the Dr. Dart like shake things that you make a face mask out of. And they had like a bunch of them. And I was like, the packaging was so cute. Like, those are so adorable. So, but I was like, oh, I'm trying to film and not read ingredients. So, Morphe, like, three pack for five bucks. Like, that's, that's crazy. That's craziness. Lancome for $16.99. Yeah, I feel bad. But at least I'm putting everything, like, back on a shelf. They have tons of Bite cosmetics as well. Tons, tons of Bite. So, if that's, like, your brand. They even had a bunch of juice stuff as well. Tons of Kate Somerville. I was really shocked. Like, you can get, like, a box set for, like, 25 bucks. I have no idea how to pronounce that. No idea. This is me trying to figure out, A, how to pronounce it, and B, where the price tag is. I finally found the price tag. $6.99. There we go. This is me not being stealthy. $8.99 for Kapari Tropical Gold Cleanser. They had so much stuff. Like, this just blows my mind. Anastasia Subculture Palette. For 20 bucks. I mean, they're, they're I, I'm just, yeah. NARS palette for 30. That's me trying to avoid a person because I don't want to like do anything weird. Dr. Jart for $12.99. More Kapari for 12 bucks. Yeah, I'm trying to be stealthy. I'm not stealthy. The Butter Bronzer from Physicians Formula, that was like $3.99. I've heard really good things about that one as well. 
and considering I don't exactly own a mo oh yeah more morphe tons tons of morphe like if you need morphe this is where you need to go because this is insane more Dr. Jart it's so much Dr. Jart stuff I'm like I'm not going to show you everything this would be we'd be here forever so this is actually like a pretty quick video Sorry, my hand's in the screen. Oh, and then I found a bunch of NARS lipsticks and MAC lipsticks, like the full-size ones, for 8 bucks, and which is which is crazy, because I went to Ulta after this, and I saw, like, the tiny ones for, like, the mini bullets, and they were 15 And I'm like, um, I just got a, a full-size one for 8 bucks. That's crazy. More MAC. This is me looking for the price tag. $5.99. So much MAC. So much Morphe. More bite. They have tons of bite. So if you're into that, definitely check that out. More Kate Somerville. The Exfoliate, which I really like and I just ran out of. So I was really excited to find that, especially for 10 bucks. More Kapari. I'm like trying to figure out what some of these are because I'm like, okay, maybe Kapari lip gloss for seven. I think it was in pineapple. NARS lipsticks for $7.99 full size. Again, like when people walk by, I just kind of look at the floor like, mm. they had Morphe lipsticks for $3.99, which is, and they were in like perfect condition too. And Hello Kitty creme, like I, I have a Hello Kitty problem. Like that's just a packaging thing. Like I, I totally got sucked into the packaging. I did. Like, I'm not going to lie. That was total packaging. So yeah, they had a ton of stuff. And this is me trying to be stealthy again, where I am in no way stealthy, like at all. I'm like, do 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 do. Trying not to. Oh, they had a bunch of stuff from Nest too for like ten dollars, and I heard that's a really popular brand as well. So, more Capari. That's Capari deodorant, which I've never tried. I just got the native one, and I haven't even really gotten into it yet because I'm trying to finish up the other one first. The Laneige Slip Sleeping Mask, they had the berry one, the green, like lime coconut one, and the blue one, which I think was like cocoa something. And this is me trying to avoid other people and be stealthy and like show all the stuff that's there without getting in trouble or anyone yelling at me. Because <laughs> I've never actually filmed anything in public before. But I figured when my husband and I went to Valentine's Day dinner at P.F. Chang's. I, I went to the restroom before eating and there were three teenage girls in there shooting a TikTok dance video in the restroom of P.F. Chang's. So I'm like, okay, well, I guess you can film things in public. And they had all the BH palettes, like all the everything. So that's about it. I'm pretty sure we're like back to where we started. So anyway, so that's... Um, what I saw ish, like I said, I've never actually like filmed. <laughs> I know it was scary. It was scary turtle bite. So what did I ended up buying? I got some of the brushes, um, because these I mean these are just the real techniques brushes, and this was like two ninety nine. I got like the big angled fluffy one, and then I got the another really really big one, which I'm really excited about. Sorry, I'm like going in and out of focus. I did get the Morphe Trio because I've never actually tried anything from Morphe. So I'm really curious. I got the Kate Somerville because I just ran out of that. I did get the Laneige. I don't know if that's a good price for that or not. I have, I have no idea. And I got a Marc Jacobs Lippy for $5.99. And I've never tried that brand either. I got a MAC full-size bullet lipstick for eight bucks I got the Kopari lip gloss the pineapple one for seven I got the big NARS one which I've also never tried for eight and then I did buy this because I've heard such great things and it was like four dollars but it says not for retail sale so when I was checking out I was like am I allowed to buy this are you allowed to sell this like I'm kind of confused but they didn't kick me out for pretending to film so that was fine and then I got like the Hello Kitty because I have a Hello Kitty problem. Total packaging. Totally aware. At least they were like really, really inexpensive. So that's what happened at Marshall's today. Sorry, this is totally in and out of focus. And so 
yeah, definitely go there. And then I went to Ulta to return the stuff that had almond in it from yesterday's video. And peer pressure made me buy the Urban Decay palette, the Wild Greens. I totally did it. I admit it. I admit it. I admit it. YouTube made me buy it. I feel bad, but I don't because I had a $10 off coupon. So I got one of those and I also got another like lip oil of the brand that I really like. So that's it. Go to the store because super, super cheap. So try the bite. Says, have a great day and subscribe.